the United Arab Emirates team organizing the COP28 climate talks, which start this week, was planning use its position hosting the summit to strike new oil and gas deals with foreign governments. According leak documents, the documents, published by UK Registered Climate Reporting Centre, appear to be briefing notes for meetings that Sultan al Jaber, who will chair the UN climate talks, will hold with foreign officials ahead of summit. These are organized as country profiles, with each document describing the talking points that al Jaber will raise at the meetings. The documents detail each country's climate progress in key areas such as finance, decarbonized food systems, renewable energy uptake, and identify how these targets can be increased. ADNOC did not respond to CNN's request for comment, but the company previously told CNN that any suggestion that it was using climate talks to promote itself was inaccurate and unfounded. The documents were first shared with the BBC. It is extremely disappointing to see the BBC using unverified documents in its reporting. The spokesman did not respond to CNN's question about whether the COP28 team was working independently of ADNOC, nor did he explicitly deny that commercial interests were discussed. The UAE is already the focus of widespread criticism over its appointment of its top oil and gas chief to chair COP28. While Al Jaber leads the summit, ADNOC plans to expand oil and gas production. According to an analysis by a fossil fuel watchdog, CNN previously reported, the wider ADNOC group is also expanding abroad in a number of other areas, including petrochemicals and renewables. In addition to talking points on climate issues and promoting ADNOC, the documents include other proposals to promote projects with Mazdar, the UAE's main renewable energy utility which Al Jaber also operates. It's unclear how many of meetings actually took place, but the notes provide a glimpse into how team hopes to use them as a tool for new deals. CNN reached 15 countries mentioned. Two of them confirmed the meeting but said no business discussions took place, while other two responded by saying no meeting took place. The countries that include information notes published by Climate Reporting Center include USA, China, France, Germany and UK. The organization said that there were 27 country profiles in total, but they decided to share 15 of them. Sultan Al Jaber during an interview in Brussels on July 13, Francois Walshart's AFP The Country, which hosts conference of the parties that changes every year usually sends its presidential candidate to meet with foreign officials to accelerate climate action before talks. The briefing notes read as expected from such meetings, right down to the end of each country's notes, which included proposals to introduce ADNOC and Mazdar. UN rules say these meetings should not be used to promote the economic interests of the host country. According to UN's climate agency, the UNFCC, 